Congratulations, Executor. Your success has brought us the promise of hope against the Zerg. However, we face a new threat within our own ranks. In your absence, Judicator Alderis and an entire legion of Kali survivors from Iyer have begun an open revolt against us. By the gods, this is ill news indeed. Why would Alderis betray us so? He and his ilk believe that it was wrong to have abandoned Iyer and consorted with our people. Their prejudices have driven them to perpetuate the Conclave's sins against us. Even now, Alderis and his loyalist Templar forces are preparing to attack our citadel. I can scarcely believe this. As if the Zerg were not enough. Matriarch, are you certain of this? All too certain, young Templar. Executor, as Matriarch of the Dark Templar and custodian of this world, I hereby order you to terminate Judicator Alderis and quell this untimely uprising without delay. There will be no dissent among us while the Zerg are poised to strike. There is something amiss here. The Matriarch has always been a wise and gentle soul. Though there is some merit in her decision, this is very unlike her. That may well be. But right now, we have a friend to kill. May I do forgive us. Be advised, Executor. Our forces are divided. Malteris has taken control of our Templar warriors and arbiters. It is possible that he may even send Archons against us. Fear not, comrades, for we have Archons of our own. Should the dire need arise, all Dark Templar may merge to become Dark Archons. Though we sacrifice our warriors in doing so, only the might of the Dark Archons can match the forces of Aldaris. Input command. Commencing. Galasas!
Iron Claws. My life for iron. Thank <laughs> you. 
Upgrade complete. Confirmed. Not time. We hear you, Zanash Grena. Input command. Sign up to the carrier and your brother. Jogal, Kokola, Lucas 
is acknowledged. It will be done. Chaos. Love is acknowledged. It will be done. Your warriors have engaged the enemy. Standing by. It will be done.
have only destroyed. Your warriors have engaged the enemy. Your warriors have engaged the enemy. the memory of Ayer by joining with you. Your fate was sealed the moment your matriarch allied herself with the Queen of Blades. Those of us still loyal to Ayer will never be slaves to Kerrigan and her broods. Alderis, be reasonable. Kerrigan has changed. She no longer seeks to enslave anyone. Do not force us to destroy you. You can no longer afford to be so naive, Artanis. 
While you were securing the crystals, I discovered that your matriarch has been harboring a dark secret. She has been manipulated by this- I have no time for this. What have you done? I just cleaned up your mess, Frotas. Don't be so squeamish. Wretched creature. This was our Protoss matter. You had no right to interfere. Be gone from this world. You are no longer welcome among us. Fine. I've done what I came here to do. I've ensured the destruction of the renegade Cerebrates, and I used you to do it. Have fun, mighty Protoss. We'll be seeing each other again. Real soon. This entire chain of events has been masterminded by Kerrigan. And we played right into her hands. Yes, we did, Artanis. Yet our course is set, nonetheless. Using the Temple's energies against the Renegade Zerg may accomplish Kerrigan's aims. But it is still our only chance of survival. And survive we will, my warriors. For too long have we labored in futile defense, as our enemies push us further and further away from victory. The time has come to let loose the full fury of our powers. Never again shall Shakuris be despoiled by the foul touch of alien species. These Zerg shall be the first to fall before us. Matriarch, I have served you for many millennia. I have always valued your wisdom and strength. Yet, lately, in your mind, I have sensed something that clouds your true spirit. Though Kerrigan has gone, I wonder if her treachery still remains. Be at ease, Zeratul. I am still the same Rashagal you have always known. These recent events have weighed heavily upon me, and I am wearied. But fear not. My warrior spirit will shine before you and light your path to victory. Indeed. The time for action is upon us. The crystals must be taken to the temple while the Zerg still muster their forces. I shall carry the Urash myself, while Zeratul handles the callus. Executor, you shall provide escort for Artanis and Zeratul as they make their way to the temple. God's willing, we will channel the energies of the Zelnaga and scour this world clean of the Zerg. Go now, my children, and know that the survival of our entire race depends upon your actions. <laughs>